Now once you have added a product, you can also edit it. To edit the product, first from your products module, go to the view products section. Over here, let's edit the product which I have just added. Here, so click on the product name. Now let's just begin with adding the proper name of the product. So I'll enter Koinu Rice. Now remember, if you delete the product type, the whole product details are erased. Next, let's add some more images. So I'll click on image link and enter the image URL and click on fetch image. So I've added one more image over here. Let's move on to the specification. So to edit these details, click on edit details button. Now let's add some more specifications over here. So here I have added some more description. Let's move to the specifications. Now here let's select the rice type. If you want to add more specifications, you can click on add custom attribute button. Now let's move ahead to synonym. Once done, click on save. Next up, you have the CLS section so you can change your unit of measurement, net weight content, or SQID. Next is the manage inventory. In case you haven't added any discount for this product, then you can do so from here. So, say I'll add 5% discount, which gives my selling price as 47.5. Once done, click on save. So this is the confirm edit inventory model which will give you the confirmation that the selling price of the current product is 50 which will now be 47.5. To confirm, click on confirm and update button. Next is this sell online button. In order to sell this product online, this button is on by default. So next you have sell online in bulk. Now if you wish to sell this product online in bulk switch on this button now you have to enter some mandatory fields over here such as the minimum quantity if my customer buys two to four packets then i'll give five percent discount so the selling price will be 47.5 let's add some more range so suppose say my customer buys five to seven packets of rice I will provide 10% of discount so the selling price will be 45 and so you can add four such ranges if you want to allow your customer to send inquiry regarding this product you can switch on this button and select the tab which is relevant for that product and enter the necessary details for now I'll keep this button off next let's edit the tags so click on edit button your HSN and SAT code is already present. Now let's add sales text for within Maharashtra and for outside Maharashtra. Let's add some purchase tags and click on save. Next, let's select the delivery profile for this product. So I'll select Maharashtra profile which has state information number of districts under the state and number of pin codes along with other details you can also edit the reorder information to do that click on this edit button once all the changes are done click on this save button so your product edited successfully now let's see if the changes made are reflected on the online store now over here let's search for a coin or rice So here is the product, the image which I had added, then the specification which I had changed, the selling price. Next I have choose to sell this product in bulk. So here are the details which I have added, two ranges, the specifications and the description. So this is how you edit 
the individual product we hope that this video was helpful to you if you still have any questions comment below or contact our support team directly for more such videos subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to never miss any update